Hi, this is Super Kaito Kito, and this is part 2 on how to make that thing in the title, the Kaku Haki something. So let's get started. So we already folded it in half. So now open it up. And you should have four squares on each, like half of the paper. Now, now is when you need the ruler, the pencil, and a marking tool and a eraser just in case. Now we want to make X's on every single square rectangle here but it's really hard to fold you have to make X's on a single uh, rectangle with corner to corner so you want to use your ruler I think I'll move my table so it's much more easier you want to use your ruler um, adjust it to the corner like so oops oh okay now aim the other like other corner and write it down Day. I missed it. Okay, so if you miss it, you just erase it. That's why you use pencils, not markers. If you use markers, you might miss. Now, just do corner to corner like so. Dang it, I can't see the corner, sorry. I should draw the corner as well. So, like right here, kind of fold it up. It should be on the corner, corner to corner, like so. Since I can't see it, and you know what I mean, I'm going to shed some light on this place. So I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. So now we want to do the same thing on the other squares. So I recommend you like you fold like you do it my way because it's faster so now you want to do it on the other squares as well but you don't want to do it square by square it takes a lot of time and patience away so you do on the second line you do it on the other square and use and then aim the other corner of the other square next across to it like the diagonal to it like so, dang it, my failure. Um, okay, something like this. So then, when you fold it later, you should fold it like this and increase it. This is what you're going to do later. So, I recommend you. Um, draw all the lines first and do it so yeah like so you want to do on the last square also so remember every square must have an X so don't miss a square because you'll need to fold it anyway so you'll notice and then now do the last square there now this is only diagonal lines you need one more by doing it the other way now the other way is the same concept except you're doing it the other way so yeah you just first 
make the first square with only um, with only corner to corner. Second square with two square X's like so. Let's see. Okay. So it's the other one. So, you have to do this precise if you want to fold it precise, unless you fold it really good. But this is pretty also critical, so if you don't aim the corners well enough, you might just fold it wrong. Now, do the last square. Now when you're done, you should have a paper full of X's, like so. Now, you want to you want to like fold these X's. It's kind of hard, but we're gonna have to do it. But since these X's take a long time, um, we'll do it on the uh, part three. So I'll see you next time.